Hello, welcome to today. I'm going to attempt to film this entire vlog on an actual camera, not my phone. I immediately regret it. I immediately, I should braid these. Can I braid these, just these strands? I'm no hairdresser, but I can always, always attempt greatness, even if I don't believe I'm going to achieve it. Oh my God, <laughs> I can't do it. Someone stop me, please. Someone just come and stop me. Don't let me keep doing <laughs> It just looks matted. Hi, welcome to today. It is Tuesday. I'm uploading my video. I've worked out. I've walked the dogs. I mentioned at the end of the last vlog, I have scheduled an appointment for laser, uh, LASIK eye surgery. So it's actually PRK, but it's pretty much the same thing. It's healing my eyes so that I can see without contacts and glasses, but it's the safest way to do it. It takes a week to recover to 80%, and then over the next six months, it'll slowly gravitate to gravitate towards the 100%. It'll slowly, it'll gradually heal to 100%. So right now the surgery is scheduled for April 26, and I will not be able to look at a screen for an entire week. Why this is happening is because I don't want my eyes to dry out because that can cause them not to heal properly and then I'll have to get the surgery again. So when we look at screens, we tend not to blink and not blinking dries out your eyes. So for four whole days, it's like just misery. I can't, I basically can't see, my eyes hurt, they're watery, they itchy. And then for three days following that, my eyes feel fine. I have 80% vision which is still legal, like I can still drive and everything and things are totally fine. It's just not completely 2020, but I still can't look at a screen. So I'm gonna have the last week of April, I can't watch TV, I can't look at my phone, I can't FaceTime, I can't edit. So it's gonna be a little little hectic. I'm gonna have to film every day until then because I'm trying to get everything done before I go to Europe. I, I wanted to get this done and they were like, this is as soon as it could happen. I'm like, great, book it and I will figure everything else around that. My girlfriend's basically gonna to have to be my eyes for a week. Brother Bear has to take on a lot of editing. Uh, like he already edits everything, but I was going to fine tune stuff. So he's gonna to have to take on more of like the uploading and publishing process of the whole thing. It's just gonna be a mess. Girlfriend's gonna to have to read me my emails. Like it's just, it's gonna be uh, interesting and I will vlog the entire thing because I can vlog without looking. I can use the camera and not look at the screen. I can just close the screen. I'm not even looking at a screen right now, which is totally fine, but I'm gonna vlog the whole process, but I just booked that last, like two days ago, yesterday. And I've just been stressed. I'm not allowed to wear my contacts until then. And again, because I don't want my eyes to dry out. And today I have to go pick up a bunch of vitamins that I have to start taking today. And they've shipped special eye drops to my house that I have to use every single day until then. It's a whole process and it's intense because usually with normal laser eye surgery, LASIK eye surgery, they um, cut a flap. <laughs> You're like the layer, even like a layer on your eye. They cut open that and then did the surgery through that. And then they put that flap back on and then you can see the next day. But that flap is like unstable. And if you have trauma to your eye or your head or whatever, that flap can move and you can basically be blind. The only terrible things that happen during LASIK is because of that flap. So with PRK, they just burn through your that whole flap area. And then it regrows after a certain amount, like after like a week. So nothing can go wrong because they're just getting rid of that thing, but it makes it a week of healing instead of one day. It's a whole thing. So I'm doing the safer one with like no risk, but it's taking longer to heal. That's what I'm doing. I'm gonna get back to work now, staring at the screens as much as I can for the next two weeks. Oh my God, it is two weeks. Oh my God, in two weeks I'm getting LASIK eye surgery. Oh my God, I'm freaking out. Okay, I can do this. Okay, so Blaze won't stop licking like this. I think he might've gotten stung by a bee or something or ate a bee. Um, he was outside by himself, but I just gave, I took his, his uh, collar off and gave him two Benadryl and gave him some treats and he has access to water, but his face looks a little swollen. I think he got stung. And pit bulls are notorious for being extremely allergic to bees. So you could, I think he got stung. Please, I have to go to the store. I don't have time for this. You poor bubby. Is it uncomfy? Is it uncomfy? It's Tuesday, which means my girlfriend has left me. She is off to work. She asked me to do a few things before she left and I already did them. I went through the shorts drawer and got rid of shorts. I got rid of the pile that was next to the bed that my things that I was supposed to, ah, I pinched my finger. Oh God, 
My hand was pinched to that. And now I am washing the dog beds and she didn't even ask me to do that. She doesn't need to, I mean, it's my house too. What is happening? Why is it? Be normal. Sorry, my try. I just realized I can make my tripod different heights using these. I could stop, I didn't know I could do that. It could stop. I just figured out something new. Anyway, <laughs> I'm actually going to film with Emily tonight for Rachel Uncensored. Um, I'm trying to figure out what I wanna do. Emily wants to do a sex episode, but I personally don't like sharing sex stories because they're not just my stories, they involve another person, and I feel like that's not right to tell their story as well in that scenario. Like, there's times when you're like, well, I don't need like allude to something, but like flat out tell stories is not my jam. Um, also, I like to keep actual stories like private for my own sake. Oh, hello! Usually you don't grace me with your presence when mama's not here. Oh, I was just checking to see if mama was here. Is she not? Is she not? I don't smell her. Ah! Oh. All right, well. See you later, bye. Uh, anyway, I don't quite know what we're gonna talk about, but that's in an hour, actually four to five minutes, whoops. And right now I'm going to film a beauty video. So you won't see it for a while, it doesn't matter. But I'm just filming and I've been editing and just working all day and I'm tired and I'm not done yet and I don't think my iced coffee did anything. <gasps> you know what my girlfriend got me for my birthday though? I told my girlfriend that I love pinatas and I love having my own pinata that I can beat senseless, senseless myself. And so she was like, okay, well get yourself a pinata. I was like, no, I can't buy my own pinata. I have to stuff it myself. So she went out and secretly bought me a pinata and stuff it full of my favorite things for me. And one of them is a five hour energy. I'm trying to stay away from carbonation because bloatation and, uh, but you can only have so much coffee and sometimes I don't want to drink a whole coffee. And energy drinks are just so nice, but energy drinks are all, they're all terrible for you. They're all terrible for you, but they're all carbonated. And so she got me this. Bottoms up, let's see what happens. Experiment, home alone, energy drink, whole thing, let's go. God, that's disgusting and poison. All right, let's film. Okay, update on Blaze Boy, he's just chilling. And I gave him Benadryl, so he's pretty much just really tired. And uh, his licking went away. And he was a little swollen and that seems to go away. He's letting me. He let me look at his mouth earlier and stuff, but he seems to be fine. He's in here because I just threw their beds, bed coverings in the wash. But he's been out and he was in the sun and uh, he seems to be doing a lot better. He's not licking anymore. We'll see what happens when the Benadryl wears off. But I think he got either like stung or bit by an insect of some sort. So he says, oh, good. you are a good boy? Pa. Give pa. Good pa. Good job, buddy. Okay, go back to sleep. He's been a drill sleepy. He's drowsy. Okay, now we film. So I'm out of time to film my beauty video. So I recorded my uh, Rachel and Censored episode with Emily first. It was really funny. We talked about all things queer sex and uh, it, was, it was very chaotic. Very chaotic, but I had a lot of fun filming it. All right, now I'm gonna attempt to film my beauty TikTok products video thing. Okay. I'm tired. I don't think the five hour energy helped. Ah! Oh, where are my girlfriend's slides? I thought there's so much hair on my foot. <laughs> Maybe the five hour energy did hit me and I just don't realize it. I turned on my camera and then I accidentally pressed zoom and it zoomed all the way into my face. That's gonna redo this. All right, that's it for uh, this video. Blaze is completely fine. It completely went away. It's the next morning and everything is totally fine. I kept an eye on him. I never ended up filming my beauty video because my girlfriend came home and was like, can I take you on the date to the movies? And I was like, yes, I would love that. So she took me on a date and we went and saw Uncharted with Tom Holland. Anyway, we enjoyed ourselves and had a fantastic little evening together, a little date. I love a date night. So I will just, do that today, which you'll see it in tomorrow's vlog. I love you guys, thanks for watching. I'm excited to get PRK LASIK. Um, Blaze is great, and that's pretty much it. That was my yesterday. It was working at home all day, and then I went on a date with my girlfriend, and I didn't vlog it because I didn't have my camera, because I was going to the movies. I guess I could have vlogged going to the movies. I did put a cute outfit on. Anyway, I love you guys, I'll talk to you later, bye.